to another episode of Sippy Sarah. Today on the show, we're going to do another request that's been on the list for a while. Um, you've probably seen the last episode, um, which is the wonderful bacon and potato bombs. So this is the same person requested this, where he had a re at a restaurant. So we're going to give it a whirl. Bacon wrapped, corn on the cob. So, I've got corn on the cob that I took, I got at the produce market, from the produce man. Uh, shaked it, took all the silky off, and washed it real good. Um, buttered our corn, salt and peppered them, and now we're just going to wrap them in bacon. I've got two ears left that I'm going to show you what to do. Now, you're going to need one or two. It depends on if you've got the little tiny ears, like in the frozen food section, you would throw out and do that. But these are kind of long, so that's probably going to take two slices of bacon. And we're just going to start it and wrap. And get you some good quality bacon. Then I, now, this is just regular... Um, Bacon not thick sliced. Okay, and then when that part right here, then we're going to start right here with our other sliced where I left off. It's okay if you got some exposed pieces. You kind of push it down a little bit. Push it down a little bit. got that one bacon wrapped. Alright, so let's do our other one. They don't have to be um, precise. You just want to get some bacon wrapped around them. Alright. And you can kind of tuck it in if you want to. But if you just lay it down, it kind of adheres to itself. And we're going to put them in a 40 degrees Fahrenheit oven. Uh, probably about 30 minutes. Because you want to get your corn done. You want to get your bacon all done and then start getting your bacon crispy. So I have to come back with video two. Now, um... I'm going to, even though I salt and peppered, you know, uh, and buttered the corn inside, just a very thin layer. Um, so the salt and pepper, I just barely salt and peppered it. Cause you know bacon is salty. So let's put some seasoning. We're gonna put some garlic powder. onion powder and a little bit of smoked paprika. And I'm going to roll them over and season the other side too. You can put your little bit of cayenne on there. Whoops! I got that a little bit too. That's okay. He didn't tell me what kind of seasoning was on the corn. He just said it was bacon wrapped so I'm just gonna kind of do it like this and then roll it and then we'll season the other side now I line my pans with non-stick aluminum foil I think that would work you know the best because this is gonna get messy Use any kind of seasoning. If you just want salt and pepper, by all means, just do salt and pepper. And then smoke paprika, which makes it look so pretty. I love smoke paprika. We go through a lot of smoke paprika and regular paprika in this house. <coughs> I 
morning. Get him out. So you do yours how you want to. All right. They'll go in the oven for about, I don't know, about 30 minutes, maybe 35, 40. You just want everything done. I'll come back with video two.